Laura from Photo USA. Today I'm going to introduce you Arc Mark Press, which is mainly used to transfer pictures on different shapes of marks. The Mark Press is very user friendly as it has an arc driving lever, which not only makes the mark better wrapped, but also the mark painting pad lasts longer in life. It's very efficient as well. The different shapes of mark haters include 1.5 ounce mark hater, 2.5 ounce, 6 ounce and 10 ounce, 11 ounce and 15 ounce, 12 ounce latte mark hater together with the 17 ounce net mark hater. The mark press is equipped with the 11 and 50 ounce mark hater when you buy from us. But if you want to imprint pictures of other marks, you can buy relative mark haters from us as well. After unpacking, we can find a plug, a menu together with the instruction video, and the mark press, which is made up of digital board, pressure handle, pressure adjustment screw, 11 ounce mark heater together with the 11 ounce mark for preheating. Next, I'm going to show you how to transfer a picture on the 11 ounce mark. The materials we need are a 11 ounce blank mark, a printed picture, and high temperature resistant tape. First step is to get the most appropriate pressure for the mark press. In order to do that, we need to try the pressure at the judgment screw for several times before getting the most appropriate pressure. Now the pressure is set. Second step, plug in. Turn on the machine. Now, let's look at the digital board. There is a screen, there are three lights, temperature set and the time. The case from left to right is minus, mode, plus, and executive. Press the mode key for once. The temperature 200 Fahrenheit represents the current temperature of the mark press. Press the mode key for the second time, the temperature and the set lights are on. We need to set the time temperature for the mark is 350 Fahrenheit. Now the temperature is set. Press the mode key for the third time. Set and the time lights are on. For a mark, we need to set the time at 15 seconds. Now, let's press the mode key for the last time and at the same time press the executive key to let the machine preheat. While the machine is preheating, we need to do the preparation work. We need to wrap the paper around the mug and then use the high temperature resistant tape to stabilize the paper on both sides. Now, the preparation work is done. While well, hearing this long bean sound, it means the preheating has been done. Now, we need to press the executive key, get out of this mug, put the mug with the paper on the inside, close the pressure handle, and then press the executive key to wait for a louder beam sound, which means it's ready. While hearing this low beam sound, it means it's ready. Now we need to turn off the machine, open the handle, take the mark out, peel off the paper. So now, a mark is been done. Just now I showed you how to make an 11 ounce mark 
but only if you want to do other sizes of marks as well. Don't worry, today I'm going to show you how to change a different mark pattern. Let's take an example of how to change to a 2.5 ounce mark pattern. The first step is to take out the 11 ounce pattern from the mark press. To change an 11 ounce mark pattern, we need first to pull out the connector with the digital bolt. Pull out. Then loosen the four screws of the mark heater. Then get it outside. We have this 2.5 ounce mark heater put inside the mark press. Then stabilize the four screws. And connect the connector with the digital board. Stabilize the screw as well. Now we have successfully changed to a 2.5 ounce mark heater. If you want to change other sizes of mark heaters, the method is the same. So this is the introduction of our ARC mark press. Should you have any other questions, feel free to visit our website or contact yourselves. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.